In this month's Alumni in Your Community, we talked to a local woman who stayed close to home and used BCC to further both her professional career and her personal interests. Hi, I'm Kathy Oldred, BCC class of 1990. After high school, I decided to go right to work because my aunt had always worked in a bank and it seemed like a great job. And then I was offered this position here at Fall River Municipal and I loved what I was doing. I also didn't really want to go away to college. So it took me several years and when my younger nephew decided that he was going off to college, I kind of thought, my gosh, I've missed out on so much. So that's when I decided I was going to go back to BCC and I started taking a few classes. Um, at that time, a, I didn't really think it was going to help my job here at the credit union, but I thought it would be a fun thing to do. When I first got to BCC, I took a couple of business classes. I took an accounting class. Um, I took a management class. Those were fun. I started to take a marketing class, but I didn't really enjoy that. I switched over to a medieval history class, and I fell in love. Um, medieval history is one of my absolute favorite subjects, and I just liked reading about it. And I found going to those particular classes, I became alive. It was a fun thing to do. I looked forward to it each week. And at that point, I came back to work and I said to my manager, I really don't want to study business anymore. And I started to take as many history classes and as many literature classes as I could. In the beginning, they were a little bit confused, but this was going back several years and not too many of our employees were actually going to college. So they felt that as long as it was going to help me and was going to make me feel more confident and more comfortable, they were, they were fine with it. They allowed me to continue taking those particular courses and there was no problem from that point on. After I graduated from BCC, I decided that I did want to further my career in school, and so I moved over to UMass Dartmouth and I had received my degree in liberal science and I moved over there and I went into humanities and social services. Again, it was a continuation of the classes that I felt were going to help me grow as a person. Well, again, lots of literature, lots of history, um, maybe some sociology, some psychology, some fun classes. What I learned specifically at BCC was the fact that I could build up my self-confidence I could then stand in front of a group of people, I could talk, I could express my opinion in a business meeting and not be afraid that I was saying something foolish or that the other managers would perhaps cut me down and say, no, that just doesn't make sense. I also learned how to write and be able to present my ideas in writing. So one of the positions that I did take on was writing procedure and policy for the credit union's retail department, which was a very important job. The fact that my self-confidence grew and that my writing skills increased meant that I was promoted first to an assistant loan manager position, then to the branch manager's position, and now I am the training manager for the credit union. That itself is a brand new position. We've never had a training manager. So I am now responsible for talking to the new employees who come in. I do some interviewing, but I actually conduct all of their training as far as how to work with the teller system, how to work with compliance, how to follow all of our regulations. I also conduct all of the mandatory training here at the credit union for the whole staff. Um, it's, a, it's very rewarding that I now have the confidence and the ability to do this type of work where I would not have been able to do that before if I hadn't gone to BCC. I have actually lived on the same street my whole life. I came home from Charlton Memorial Hospital and I plan to stay there until I move to the next spot. <laughs> um, I've lived on Summerfield Street. I absolutely love the city of Fall River. One of the reasons I was so glad to be able to go to BCC is because it was close. It was um, a, a warm campus. It was a welcoming campus and it was also community based. So there were people there that I actually knew from the community and I enjoyed that a lot. I am not married, I am single. I do have the most fabulous dog who shares my life, but I have decided that I would like to be involved in different areas of the community. So what I have done is started to teach junior achievement classes. I've been doing that for about a 10 year period and I love going into the classroom, pretending that I am a teacher for an hour a week and I go over the lessons with them. I think it is a great way to get children on their way to have a better career and a better life. 
One of the things I also do as part of JA is in stress on them how important it is for them to continue with their education, and I always tell them about my time at BCC. Other things I've become involved in is the South Coast Opera Club. I have been the treasurer and the president. I am also involved in the Greater Fall River Symphony Society, which as you know is housed at BCC. That's where they perform, that is where they um, rehearse, and it's great to be part, again, of more community activities. I love to bring BCC up in a particular conversation, especially when I'm interviewing new employees. Many of them are just coming out of high school, and they're not sure what they want to do with their life. They think they'd like to go to college. I immediately tell them about BCC, explain how the classes are so easy to take, how they will fit into the schedules. I also like to let employees know who are here now who think they would like to perhaps move up within the organization, but they do need some education. Going to BCC is a great way to do it. Also like to stress that because um, people, when they are going into school, they might need to have a little bit of flexibility with their schedule. We try and work with them. If they've got to take classes, we'll let them get out a little bit early just so that they can get to school, especially BCCs right up the street from us. I never thought while I was at school that I was going to get to the position that I am today. First of all, I never thought I'd be able to do such a thing. But I will definitely say that going to BCC and taking those classes and learning how to think, which was an incredibly important part of taking any type of class that you can get from point A to point F and understand that there are multiple steps in between, um, I learned that at BCC. And then now I'm doing this new job as a training manager. Again, I have to go from point A to point F and figure out what's got to be done in between. So it's taught me incredibly great thought processes in order to be able to do my job as well as I can.